we're gonna do dread x collection which is like the horror trash game collection but different so we're gonna do that um i was reading the reviews before i got this bundle thingy collection and there is some collections are like seven games or there are 10 games other collections are 13 games i don't know there's different games some of them are really bad like i'm talking trash and then others are decent and then a few are good so we're gonna have to dig into the shit to find out okay so we're gonna go into dread x collection the first one um here we go first time I, I literally have no idea what this game was about i just saw this bundle i saw what the games were about and i was like all right since good enough everyone fears losing their mind hold up hold up hold up hold up Dis hold up bro let me catch you the game maybe it's good trash maybe wait wait wait, wait. i want to watch the intro again Everyone fears losing their mind. Disease, loneliness, trauma, prolonged pressure, time. There are countless ways our minds can be upgraded one before it dies. So we invent routines that can hopefully carry us from and back to our pillows intact. Slicing up the days into chunks that can be more easily digested. We toil away and pretend it gives us purpose, supporting lives we hope are stable and relieve ourselves with smaller, more manageable oblivions. When we become dissatisfied with the process, we try to rebalance our needs. Less dairy, more gym, less booze, more weed, less gym, more dairy, etc. But the balancing act never ends. The cycle never stops. Sanity is a construct, an artificial invention of humanity, and like all constructs from the mightiest skyscraper to a Lego house, it must be maintained. When your maintenance fails and the edifice crumbles, you will realize that the creeping dark comes not from without, but within. Oh, shit. Oh, I sanity like that intro. Was always the unnatural state. Oh! Sanity was the invader. At the end of that long and tropic road, when all your humanity and sense is withered away, only the madness remains. Okay, good intro. I like it. There is a lot of great indie games. Yeah, for sure. We love indie games here. <laughs> so this collection cost me one euro and 60 cents. So let's see if the money was worth it. What if we rate every game from 1 to 10 when we finish it? I'm, I don't know how long the games are. Maybe the games are like 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour. I have literally no idea. But uh, I guess I have to pick which one I start. Is there options or something? Menu. So we are on full screen, 1080p, oh, instructions. Okay, click the mirror icon to change your selected game. Uh, click inside the mirror to launch your selected game. Okay, click on the photo frame to learn more about the selected game. One for each. Click on the letter to hear the selected game's audio tape. One for each. Okay. <clears throat> Interesting. So where should we start? I guess we're gonna do we're gonna do clockwise. Okay. We're gonna do clockwise, or we're gonna, we're gonna start at uh, at midnight, twelve. So the pay is nice, odd Bruce. The pay is nice. Subject zero one 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 zero 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 zero. Discover what happens in an ultra secure facility as you get ready for work. 
and wander the dark halls of your office. Using old school fixed camera perspective, they are watching your every moves. <clears throat> okay. So one of the more uh, intolerable habits of uh, first year ethics students is their seemingly unquenchable passion to constantly debate tired and ultimately pointless dilemmas. None of Been which there. is more tired and pointless than the trolley problem. Do you stand by and let the trolley kill five people, or do you flip a switch and direct the trolley to hit only one? Uh, it generally devolves into a protracted debate mm -hmm. on the utilitarian uh, valuing of various peoples that would be okay to sacrifice over others. That is, after the deontological wankers have since declared their superiority and are now drinking healthy gulps of their own self-satisfaction. <coughs> uh... Unfortunately, they rarely see the fundamental absurdity of the entire experiment. I mean, the choice of the many versus a few doesn't happen in a vacuum. A triage doctor doesn't choose to save the healthier patients just the once. They do so every time such an emergency arises. And the reasoning is simple. Biology dictates that we all subconsciously assume we will be part of the many. We preserve the group because it will help us preserve ourselves. And in return, the group gives us a reasonable abstraction as to how our uh, actions are justified. You know, trickle this greater good down a few levels and you can see how someone can work for 10 years selling running shoes and never ask who made them. You know, the real lesson of the trolley car is that clarity is absurdity. Abstraction is reality. Wow, I never thought about this in this way, I guess. It makes sense. Good take. Alright, I love this presentation or anything. I love it. Now the games it themselves, we'll have to see. But here we go. <clears throat> okay, so we are at the pay is nice. Here we go. New game. Yay. But the, the screen tearing is awful. You're pretty good. <laughs> Should I play this with controller? Mindfulness become the better future. Girls or men? Woman or woman? I cannot sprint. There's a green locker there. Take off the jacket. Take off the dirty boots. Change outside pants for inside pants. Put on the clean shoes. Okay, we are ready. I'm a scientist. That's what I'm supposed to say if anyone asks. I never really studied to become a scientist. I, uh, I have all, just always been obsessed with process and experiments. I was recruited to work for this company. I'm not sure how they found me, but they sent me a letter. I almost threw the letter away, but I'm glad I didn't. The pay is nice. It's a trap! Where was I? Put the smoke on. Put the book away. Empty the pockets. Mindfulness works on secret projects to help humanity improve at an exponential rate. If you are systematic, can follow, can follow instructions and have effective routine communications, come and work with us. That's what the job description mentioned. The company doesn't have a website, but I know, if, I know they have existed for more than 20 years. I did my research. I'm a scientist. The pay is nice. So is that your excuse? The pay is nice, so you will, you will do anything? <clears throat> Turn off the cell phone. Store the cell phone. Close the locker. Lock the locker. Pull on the lock. Make sure it's locked. <laughs> okay. I guess if you ever guys wanted to make a video game of your own, this will be the result, kind of. This is like a like a mini game, like a mini game, like a test game, I guess. Simple assets, simple elements, simple levels, simple mechanics. A little bit of story, and that's it. You have a game. 
For some people, money is the only thing that counts. Yep. The job description wasn't too interesting, but I was in a rough spot. The company I worked for closed. Something about cash flow issues. I don't know much about business, but I was told this happens a lot. Hello, man. Welcome. How are you? Hey, yo, yo. What are you? <laughs> We're playing uh, Dread X Collection, a collection of mini games. Each one different from the other. And we just start that first one. So, yeah. I didn't read the second part of the paragraph. Sorry. Look at this reflection. Oh, shit. Why oh, is there no one here, though? Perception. Weird. Sun is not here. Hmm. Offices. Let's go to the office. The damn light's broken again. So this is not his first time here, I guess. Hola, hola. Salut. Bonjour. Common Titapel Security Checkpoint. There's no one here. Scan the key card. Open the door. Stay silent. Not not at the guard. Walk through the door. Oh, a pistol. A job that contributes to the advancements of humankind is no simple task. There is a reason this is an ultra security facility and that not an authorized person can go inside. I'm reading behind the camera. Even I don't know everything that happens between these walls. I don't question what I'm being told to do. The pay is nice. <clears throat> Pick up the hunt gun. Load the magazine. Remove the safety. Cock the gun. Oh! Did he just shoot someone? Um, hello? Was that a real person? Stay silent. Wait for the lights. Stay in the lights. Walk to the office. Stay silent. They are watching. This is a stress meter. Bro, bro, bro. Press to the max. The company is obsessed with security. We work on sensitive research, probably funded by the government. Most of the information is redacted when I receive it. They make sure the schedule for of the other researchers doesn't overlap. Do you never cross someone in the hallway? They open only the required lights on the way to my office. Everything else is pitch dark. The door locks after I step into my office. I'll need to ask permission if I need to use the bathroom, but I don't question it. The pay is nice. Hello, who is this handsome guy on the screen? I don't know. Maybe you have a mirror. Maybe you have a mirror on your PC. On your monitor. Oh! It's a me. And these are the instructions of what I need to do today. Oh, you guys cannot see, but I'm ready for you. Don't worry. Instructions. All right, time to get to work. Here's the process I have in mind to get through today. Step one, determine which medications combinations will leave the subject with a positive benefit and no side ill effects. Even better if we can get something to plus plus. Step two, find the optimal hardware configuration for the CAMS XQ39 that are supported by those by the chosen medications. Step 3. Submit for validation. 
there is a lot of experimentation and trial and error in this job. If I'm unsure, I can submit any solution and proceed. The system will just run tests for me. It's easy pay. I have Pavlos dog you enough. Oh, this briefcase is killing me. I should drop it off on my other desk before I sit down. Okay, mint. Fuck. The briefcase is heavy. At least now I can run if I need. Oh, we can run now. Oh, great. They already got their autopsy report out. Sounds about right. This is the guy that we just kill. Name Michael Resman, age 32. Cause of death sudden cardiopulmonary arrest due to abusive cocaine and methamphetamine use. Sure. Okay, I can sprint now. So, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> Pull back the chair, start the computer, sit down, move the chair forward, enter my password. We do experiments on the human brain. We improve them by freezing the state they work in. At least that's what they are promising. I gather data, do analysis, and enter new values in the software. I vary the amount of medicine and hardware specifications to test different scenarios. The software runs simulations on my, par on my parameters, and if the results are good, they will send me in the experiment room. The pay is nice. Okay, do I need to do anything here? Oh shit. Uh, guys, I need help. Next step, I should find all the notes I have misplaced around the office. Wait, there's more notes around? Maybe over here? Match requirements. Okay, I don't know how we're gonna do this. Let's check this other room. What the hell is this room? Someone drop a Lego? I have fishes! With all the gross things I see in here, it's good to have interesting fishes to look at. Another note. Good thing I have my glasses to read the label of these trucks. Met side effects. I have narrowed down the effects and counters for each medication that were identified in the note one. Now I just need to match them up and make a super medicine that will help us go forward. I have a strong feeling that we should start penoxaline as a base. Let's see. Let's try this. So. Let's see. We have a voltage of three. Um, oh, but I need a voltage of No, that doesn't work either 11? Can I do 11? No, 11 is not unique Let's do 4 Alright, so we have 0, 3, 4, 5, 6 I don't know how to do this I don't know how to do this! This game looks complicated I don't know how to do this. I don't know what lurking do to work. Buena suerte, gracias, Bell. Thank you very much. First up and bye. Signs going on here, step back, roll, explode. I don't know what's happening. Oh, this is cool because we have a 9 and 8. This is cool, but it's... Yeah, I think this is all unique. We have 0, 2, 3, 4, 5, 9, 8. That should work. Oh, so we're going to get that seal, right? Let, let, let's try this. Not too confident about that one. Oh, well, we'll see what the experiment says about it. Fuck it. Joel, guys, it, the side effects don't count. We don't give a fuck. Save the changes. Stun up. Put the chair back. Wait for the door to unlock. We did it, guys. We did it. That was all we had to do. That's my calling. Time to head out.
The experiment room is down this hallway. These empty holes give me the creep. This shit is never working every single time. I have done some bad things. Things I'm not proud of. And I could not read the rest. What if we fail making the medicine and now they're gonna inject it to us? They're gonna we are the test subject. <laughs> this place is so dark, I can't barely see anything. Seems like the tests I've completed already. Let's see. There are four test subjects to validate. Patient 165 died. Let's see. Cause of death, car accident. Head on collision, sudden death. Sure. Let's see how patient 166 is doing. Results. Increased pulmonary efficiency by 12%. Vital stable. Success. Hey, let's go. Patient. Wait, what the fuck? The body's empty. Where is my fucking car? Oh no, I'm so fucked. Uh oh. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna do uh We're gonna do a poll. Hey, we have a poll. You're pretty good. How do you do? How do you do the options in the poll? Oh, here we go. Let, let's do for every game we play. We're gonna do a poll. The pay is nice. We're gonna do this or that. There we go. Well, you have sixty seconds to vote, guys. That's 60 seconds to vote. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Vote. <laughs> I, I gave a few options, okay? I gave a few options. Kappa? I wonder if you can actually create the good medicine and it will have a different ending. Pay is suspended until further notice. That is the achievement I got. Oh, and also it shows, it shows on the mirror that I completed that one. You see, you guys see there, like. Uh, it's 10 seconds to vote, anyone who hasn't vote. Anyone who hasn't vote, 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 vote. All right. I should have like two emojis. Um, well. The pay is nice with three boats. It says the game is trash. Trash game. Uh, next. Don't go out. Don't go out. Just don't. Click on the character on character to select. Then choose action. Click and drag cards to use. Okay. You know, we all think we're the big hero of our own lives. The good guy standing up to the bad guy, getting the girl, show- Oh. What the fuck? You know, we all think we're the big hero Sorry. of our own lives. The good guy standing up to the bad guy, getting the girl, showing the world just how special we, we know we are. You know, but when the sun goes down and instinct takes over, you quickly learn that the darkness doesn't share your delusions of grandeur. We only ever hear the stories of the survivors. The dead don't get to tell us their side. Okay. Don't go out. Here we go. Alright, so this is called not don't go out. Let's see how this one goes. 9 p.m. Nine more hours. One action remains. You okay, Loon? So I have this character. Oh, you're set for Polygon. This is Sam. This has 21 HP, I'm guessing. Oh, okay. And then we have React Quickly, Lucky Fine, or Light Them Up. Move, way die. We're gonna move away from the monster, I guess. It's coming. What did he say? It's 
10 p.m. Eight more hours. All right, so we just have to make time. Hearts. Beely, light them up, lucky fine. Did you hear something? Oh shit, it's coming closer. Seven more hours. Uh, react quickly. Blood ritual. What the fuck? You must play party members next to one another. Okay. Wait, what? There you go. Now we have two people. I'm gonna move away from this thing, to be honest, because it's coming from the left. It's coming for us! Oh shit, it's right there! We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We're dead. We are dead. What if we do... Interact? What is that thing? Die. That scared the fuck out of me, holy shit. Adrian, Jerry, Boar, what do we do? Light them up? Oh shit. Oh, that's the exit. Okay, in that case, see a later. See a later, there. Something's coming! But. Uh, 1 a.m., five more hours. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh. Shoot flare. Let's put. Wait, 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 wait. I'm learning how to play this game, okay? Oh my god. How do you play this? You must play party member next to each other. That's what I tried to do, game. Oh my god. How do you play this? Oh, there you go. I can still move. We need to go up. Something's coming. Oh shit. That one died too. Second look. Am I dead? Blood ritual. Should we do blood ritual? Fuck it. YOLO. I think Get the fuck out Wait, what is happening? I have more More options She do not have enough cars Okay, that's true, that's true, that's true I need three cars for that Shoot flare Okay Why can't I not move up? I just, I just need to make time I don't understand. I don't understand what that said. Oh my god. It's expand three more hours. I don't think I can make it, guys. I don't think I can make it. I think I'm dead. Drop and run. Fucking yes. Oh, on the top left this is how many actions you have left. Wait. Move down. Oh no. What was that? Ah, oh, shit, I lost. I lost. All that remains of sporadic cause and needle sting. Well, you're getting better then. Back to the game. What do I do? I'm dead. I have no characters left. Oh, let's try again. Let's try again. Let's try again. Any ideas? I don't know good at strategy games. I'm missing some mechanic. I just don't know how to stop the thingy from advancing. Let me go all the way up. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, okay, okay. Eight more hours. Let's go all the way up. 
Maybe I have to distract the monster with one character. I have to split the characters, maybe? Is that a good idea? Interact. Oh! It's getting close. Wait. I opened this thing now. Oh, but there's another monster in here, I think. Six more hours. Okay. There is no more torches. I can see shit. Uh, I have Billy, Adrian, Lucky Fine, Second Look. Second Look. I need to light them up. Wait, wait, wait. Let's do. Yeah, let's do light them up. Yeah, what the fuck is that monster there? What the fuck is that thing? Let's do with him. We're gonna move here. We're gonna use the ritual here to block that monster in case it comes. And with her, we'll move here to move inside this room. Okay, and now we're gonna do this. We're doing better this time, I think. Five more hours. I, I think that was the key to find this ring. Supply gache. It's you and me. Shoot the flare. Let's shoot that flare there. Ah, if I shoot it one more square, I will have hit the monster. She. We're gonna move inside this room, I think. I'm putting all my eggs in one basket though. Oh, now I'm just gonna wait. Getting closer. Oh shit. Oh shit. This is a mistake. Can I get out of here somewhere doing something? No. Well, I really hope that the Chris that sacrificial thing it works against the monster oh no the three more hours the red tentacles are getting inside she bro oh well we're dead we're dead oh come on two more hours i was so close i was so close Game over. Fucking hell. Two square per turn. This is why I don't play strategy games, by the way, guys. I have never streamed strategy games, and this is why. I hate this shit. Uh, it seems that you just had to survive the night. I know, but... I had to survive nine turns. Um, uh, I lasted eight a few times, but the... I just get overwhelmed. So, no. Going to the house. Okay. Did you look at playthrough or something? <laughs> I'm curious to. No? Okay. But if you get into the house, the the tentacles get inside, and then you can't do anything else. Go into the lake and grab some holy water. I wish. Bro, I need more actions. There you go. You can't close the door behind you? Okay, I'm gonna try that now. I'm gonna try that now. Five more hours. 
Oh, you can. Okay, those two guys are dead. <laughs> now, the only problem is the monster inside the house. That is the only problem. So, <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, Lun. I was focusing on my drawing. Where are you drawing? You see, the monster is here now. Let's put the blood ritual here or under him. No, it doesn't work. I need to move away. Oh, that guy's dead. Everyone is dead. Okay. I don't know where the monster is. Light the target. Bro, I wanted to throw it there, but I I'm going to assume it's not next to me. I'm going to assume it's not next to me. Please don't die. I can move here and check, I guess. Oh, yeah, he's there. So I need to move back. Oh! Uh, how many? Two more hours. Can I do it? Can I do it? I'm scared of... Wait, wait. Ray can't be here. Uh, I think we got it, guys. I think we got it. If you move there, do I survive? I'm not sure. Maybe I can do more acts and less cards. Second look. No! Wait, what? Wait, why can't I not use cards with him? Oh, but that works. Did we get it? <laughs> Did we survive? Let's go! Let's go! The tree was to close the door behind you. Holy. You survived for now. That was the first level. There's 10 levels. Survive the night. We survive. All right, we got it. We got it. That was fun. Uh, two games completed. <sighs> okay, let's do uh, another poll. <laughs> let's do another poll. Don't go out. Good. Crash. There you go. Paul is active. The poll is active. The poll is active, boys. <laughs> we have divided opinions. Divided opinions. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Oh. We have three good boats, one trash boat. So far. Okay, interesting. Who voted for trash? The fuck? <laughs> well, I'm glad you guys think that game was good. It was like a mini puzzle, I guess. The tree was to close the door behind you. Ah. Well, don't go out. Wins the wins the poll with a three votes to good. Nice. Okay. Next, hand of doom. A trap in an arcane realm by the dark sorcery of the Ubi Ubiquitous Master. Can you learn the correct rituals and incarnations needed to escape? 
Click words of power on right to ready spell and then incant the cast. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Internal memorandum regarding the effectiveness of continual disinformation report. Okay. Now, by now, all members of our mental, safekeeping, and collective mindscape gerrymandering team should have already read the attached report. I want to applaud the research staff of the Department of Psychological Restructuring for their diligent work and conclusive results. While our previous primary methods of widespread mental manipulation revolved around the cultivation of distrust towards monolithic outsider groups, both the research and our own experience shows this method to be far too reliant on the outside group remaining a viable threat. And despite our considerable resources, we cannot undo the Andromiophage. However, the Don't DPR solution is both simpler and more sustainable by instead supporting smaller-scale radical theories conceived naturally by the public, the general level of disinformation is shown to be far higher. These organic conspiracies will drastically reduce our overall expenditures. This comes with the added benefit of further fractured collective consciousness, halting the spread of the cognitovirus by an additional 60%. While I appreciate the work of our veteran disinformation <laughs> producers, not even the best of us could have come up with a way to convince people the Earth is round. <laughs> I was believe the one crackpot about that. theory, believe them all. Okay, this, this is very interesting about these conspiracy people. Like, yeah, the lack of a critical thinking or like a method to filter ideas or how to test them, and then. It's very interesting how maybe even the government is like spreading misinformation to to confuse the population in general. Very cool. Interesting. All right, hand of doom. Here we go. Oh shit! This this one looks awful already. Thirteen is thirteen. Okay, okay. Um, this reminds me of that Dungeons game that you can move to the side. Which one is this? It is that one. Polygon, you must know it. Who did figure? Tal F. East Ort. Okay. Good old Doom. The fuck is this? Also, okay. A grimoire. It's a book of dread incar incantations. Press it to interact. Grimoire. Surely this will be useful. Also, oh, I, ha I have spells now. So we have F. Incant. Incantation. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, boy. Okay. So what was the one that that guy tell us? F. Tal is Ort. Do incantation fail? Oh! F is Tal Ort. What was the one they told us? Oh, there you go. You caused Oath of Flame. So... I'm gonna do... Oh, I think I fucked up, though. I'm gonna do, like, combinations of, like... One... Two, three, four, then one, three, two, four, and still like that. The incantation rune spell reminds me of Arc Fatalis. Oh, does it have a similar system? A locked door. Perhaps a spell could unlock it. Uh, a spell could unlock the door. A locked door. 
Tal S is Ort. Tal F. Tal L is Ort. Okay. Tal F is Ort. Oh! We're gaming. Enter the dark dungeon. Hedge wizard. You must be the newest resident of this place. How did you escape from the dungeon? You may have been better off staying locked up. That reminds me of Fury. Okay. Is there anything over here? Little bit of exploring. When the dagger is yours, the seal will be broken. Okay, we need a dagger. The voice spell seems similar. Oh, okay. Uh, art is tall. Let's do a random combination. the tomb well let's go in here in the middle what is this thing a fountain of blood blood fountain refill your blood yes your vitality has been replenished let's fucking go some incantations may require a sacrifice of blood oh. If you ever find yourself running alone, we need return all the blood. To the fountain. We need all the blood. Alright, so how do I continue the story though? There are different doors and shit. Here lies the dungeon, both dark and fell. The way is shut. Lest you cast the right spell. So how do we... Tal F is Ort. What? Can this Tal unlock the door? F is Ort. Oh, I did it. What is it playing for? Is to see? Retrieve the artifact from the dungeon. Oh shit, here we go. We need to retrieve the artifact from the dungeon. I forgot the code. Uh, F is Talor. F is Talor. F is Talor. We need to remember that. To see. Not get lost. Can I lead this? Oh, that's a skeleton. I need the artifact. Oh shit, it's gonna get dark. Oh! What the fuck was that? I gotta remember these four things, man. At least. What was that? Can we die? Is there enemies? Can they kill us? Oh, we can't lead that. Nice. Nice. Okay. That's the entrance, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, it has to be. Wait. What? 
I search everything. I search it everything. Is the orc. There was nothing here. What is that? What is that? Do we need to kill that guy maybe to to get the dagger from here or the artifact from here? From him? I don't know how to kill him though. I'm leading all the torches at least. He's behind me. I don't know what to do here. Let me try to go to a different place. Okay, so we are here. I believe I came through here. No, this is the tomb. Let's talk to this guy. The master's body is interred here, but not his spirit. It may be possible to banish the soul with the right spell. Oh. So we need to learn more spells. Ah, uh, fuck! You says a new power. What? Do you sense any power in the dungeon? Uh, Bro, do you have to lead uh, the torches? Do you uh, have to lead the torches, I think. I was I had one torch unlit. That is so stupid. That's the shit, bro. Is the orc. It's always something stupid, yeah. Okay, bro. Well, we got the dagger. With the dagger. Sacrificial dagger. We can open the door. The door was this way, I think. Oh my god. I had to lit one torch. Really, bro? I thought that was optional. I thought that was like, oh, you lit this so you can see it better, basically. When the dagger is yours. When light torches unseen, then cast spell to open. Air is the orc. Oh! Wait, what? Oh. The door can be open now. Uh, a locked door. Perhaps the spell can unlock it. Tal F is Ort. Can you queue up spells? Yeah, you can do like blah 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 blah. There you go. We got it. We're gonna refill our blood. Man, this game collection. Like I said, is a is a hit or miss. It's a hit or miss. I was reading the reviews before and from the people reviews apparently from every collection there is like two or three really good games so let's see if we can find those retrieve the artifact from the graveyard okay here we go again here we go again this time we're gonna think on on that we may have to do all the boxes or all the all the torches, blah, blah, blah. 
Oh shit, look at that guy. Is this an enemy? Huh? Oh! There he goes, this... Tal F... Knife. Tal F oh. knife. <clears throat> oh! We opened the... We opened the... The barrier. But to speak the runes, you had to troll them with your mouse and a voice to spoke them. Holy shit, that reminds me of Harry Potter. Harry Potter had a similar, like, you had to do the spell of the... Of the wand with the, with the mouse, right? I forgot what it was. Hal F knife. Well, I may run out of blood. Hello? If you are low on blood, remember. Tal Fort Fort F if Repenish blood? That's cheating, bro. Tal Ort Ort F is I'm draining your blood. <laughs> nice. Look at these ghosties. They're very spooky. Can I get past them? Thank you, Lou, for the 12 BDs. How many... How many BDs are we at? I think we are at this number, but I'm not going to tell you the number. <laughs> now grab a sample and see if it's actual blood or Kool-Aid. Oh! No! Your incantation fail. Okay, we need to replenish blood. Nice. Where is the item that I need from the graveyard, bro? The ghosts are closing me in. They're closing me here. I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. Maybe this way? Because if you if you get past the ghost, they appear behind you. Oh, there you go. We got it easy, guys. Or of true death, the power over death itself only. You feel compelled to take it. I love the sound when you stab your hand. <laughs> Who are you gonna call? Oh, we got the orb. Let's see. Orb of true death. So now we're gonna go to the pyramid. First, we're gonna replenish the... Enter the tomb. Holy. Holy. Look, there are ghosts here now. <laughs> there are ghosts this year. I don't know if those were there before. Uh, let's go to the tomb of the master. And we use the... Let's see. We're gonna leave this torch. The secret is revealed. Oh! A log gate. Perhaps a spell could unlock it. Taleth is ord. Progress. Once I got past the dungeon, everything has been going. Blowing. There you go. Let's talk to this guy. Maybe he says something. The master's body is nope. eternity, but not his spirit. 
Place the orb at the altar. Banish the master's soul. Holy. The altar accepts your offering. Recite the holy incarnation. I don't know the holy incarnation, guys. Oh, oh, oh. it's on the walls. Can I cast the spell as I look around? Oh, I can't. Okay. So then I can't just cast it and move it. What am I doing? Okay, let's see if this works. The master! You fool. You thought you were going to banish me? I resurrected him. I was guiding you towards my resurrection the whole time. Now, I live again. And cool. you shall be the first to die. Are you sure about that? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that was fun. It's midnight already. I've been streaming for two hours. Okay. Thanks for playing. A playable teaser. I'm not sure if this is like a standalone game and this is like a demo. <laughs> Does that count as completing the game? I hope so. Oh, oh, uh, 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 uh. That was cool. Okay, so let's do let's do another boat here for Hand of Doom. There you go. Oh, you can boat now. Don't torture your house now. <laughs> Okay, one soul for another. Seal the blood pact. And another one. And another one. Completed. We completed three games so far. How many are we have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there is ten. Let's try to do like five today. And then five the next time. Alright, let's see the boats. Let's see the boats. <laughs> you guys are very nice. You guys are very generous. Flame on. This is an inside me torch, so I can only burn myself. Boom. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> uh. Okay. So, Hand of Doom is a masterpiece confirmed by chat and me. Nice. Well, I, I'm not sure if you guys are trolling the boats or you're actually being serious. But if you're having fun, that's all I want. Summer night. Run around in your backyard picking toadstool and just chasing monkeys in this LCD handheld game where nothing scary happens. Oh, fuck. You, you know that feeling when you're just suddenly uncomfortable? Uh-huh. So you're you're in your living room, yeah. wrapped up snug in a warm blanket, watching uh -huh. some trashy uh, daytime TV you secretly love. The world just melting away. Mm -hmm. And in a moment, you lose it. Not from some thumping outside your door or, or an unexpected call from your ex. You just realize that it's been far too long since you checked if there was anyone behind you. Oh, shit. You'll reflexively turn, but it never stops there. The fierce cascade. Did you remember to lock the front door? No! Was it you that left the bathroom light on? Yes! Is that where you left your soda when you finished lunch? No, it moved along. Suddenly, you're under siege by every monster of your imagination. And you never even had to leave. 
your room. Oh, oh shit. shit. Yep. <laughs> Summer nights. Here we go. Hey. <sighs> Absolutely nothing scary happens in this game. For best results, play in a dark room and wear headphones. Use Alt F4 to leave at any time. Press spacebar to play. Press press escape key to turn back now. <laughs> this is a very cool intro sign. By telling you nothing scary happens, you may be you may lower your guard and then something actually scary happens and it's like oh and you weren't prepared for it. So that's a cool tactic. I like that. Oh, it's a friendly game. <laughs> Yo, the fuck new. And then they tell they even tell you to Alt F4. All right, here we go. Like this. Move left, and the character boop, like that. There's a moon. We have a loon. We have to collect everything! Okay, 20. 420. Easy. Bra 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 bra. It's rolling. I need a break game. I have to read the chat. <laughs> okay, 40. Was one of those games. I had Turtles games and Mickey Mouse game like this. Really? Bro, this is so nostalgic. Do you guys think something is going to. Oh! I'm so way too far, Jasker. <laughs> I was literally gonna ask you, do you guys think anything is gonna actually happen or is this just a troll game? And then, as I'm saying the sentence... Oh my uh, god! Okay, it's happening! Everybody stay calm! What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? Stay calm! Oh, shoot! Thank you, Ricky, for the 10 meters! How are you, sir? We're playing Dread Collection. We're just playing a random collection of games. Let me pass through, motherfuckers. 66. War Breeze. I wish for I wish for something to happen. When we were kids, I had this uh, on our wrist. Can I break these trash bags? I guess not. Hello, wait, what is that emoji? A dab? Oh! Rick is lying on me. Boom. Doing good, man. How about you? It's a. Doing okay. Catch a falling star. I'm trying my best to survive these games, but they are not easy. Funny fungus. Um. Oh, I lose hearts. I'm losing hearts. I lose an HP if I pick up the bad fungus. What is that noise? What is that noise? What is that fucking noise? You fucking bitch.
Bro. Stop playing the game, look behind you. You, I, I, I'm gonna die. I have half a heart. Good old phone games in 90s, for real. Meet in the park. Okay, I got my, my HP back. What? Bro, it's impossible to know beforehand if it's gonna damage you or not. Yeah, you just get close to it and it, 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 it damages you. <laughs> what if you just leave the mushroom? But I have to pick them to purge the level. But you, I just wait here, Loon? I have to pick them up. But the moment I get close, I have no way of knowing if it's a good one or a bad one. At least you don't die, but... I I'm one hit away. Please finish the level! Oh, I'm dead. Life goes on. Get the star, man! Do I need to start again? Or what? Funny fungus. Oh shit. There was that there was some very creepy music before. There was like a very, very creepy music before. Is it like we are playing a game on the console and then there's stuff happening around us? What if the game suddenly starts being like this screen and then the the, the, the console gets put away and there's like something scary? That would be fucking That'll be Wait, I, I dodged it. I dodged it. Oh, I know how to dodge the bathroom now. I learned how to do it. I learned how to do it. So, a phone, uh, a phone game that, that... Did you also have battery? Uh, you had to go in front of the mushroom and then don't go straight. You had to go down. There you go. Alright, there you go. That's easy. Meet in the park. Meet me in the park. Meet who? Alright, we have to reach uh, a thousand points again. Not a thousand, a hundred. We got this. We got this in the back. Hello, Capper. Welcome. Thank you for the Lurkies. We got this now, though. We got this now. We're already at 50. The poo poo! Take the trash out. No, we don't take that one. Okay, we're already at 55. I'm spinning right on this game. I have the war regular, war regular holder of uh, Summer Night. The hardest game ever made. Time flies. Look at the moon! Look at the moon! Somebody's knocking at the door. What the fuck is this game? Bro. 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 <laughs> Hairy situation. Time for a hitless run? I can. You're so focused on the game that you kind of lose track of what's going on around you. Like that note at the beginning before starting the game about watching the TV and then not realizing. How long was the last time you shake over your shoulder? Oh shit. Can you do continue to play? I'm gonna answer at the door. <laughs> oh! 
69, nice. Catch a falling star. I hear more noises. Bro, this game is actually scary. Me. Creepy Crowley. Girl, look at the fucking moon. It's so stupid. This is a fucking game with like sounds around you. And it's so effective. Uh, this is actually genius. I hear something crawling. That hit me. Oh, you have to move away fast. Okay. Someone is unlocking the door or something? Picking the lock? Coming closer. Ah! It's just behind you? No, it's behind you. Error. Uh, um... It's cursed. There is a lot of creepy bastards about cursed games. Okay. Hi guys. It's been nice to meet you. Motherfucker. Good night. I'm so nervous I had to laugh to relieve some pressure. Battery. The battery is, is dying, guys. The battery of the console is dying. Fine batteries. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh shit, now we have to actually play the game in real life. Oh, what the fuck is that thing? What the fuck is that?
Oh. 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 That was actually really good. I, I really enjoyed that. But we have to make a poll, though. We have to make a poll. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> You're pretty good. Alright. Uh, we have a poll in the chat. We have 60 seconds. You can have multiple boats. You can have multiple boats. I'm not gonna tell you, Loon. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna tell you. We are at 42. Alright, boats are allowed. Please vote. Everyone vote in the chat. <laughs> uh... Please, everyone, vote. Yeah. We are at 42 total right now. We were at 30... Wait. Yeah, Rick did 10. When... How many? You did 12. Wait, maybe... No, no, we have... <laughs> we have a beam. We have a beam. Well, uh, Summer Night is, uh, has been consensuated to be a wonk material by the chat. Okay, back to um, Dread Collection. We're gonna do Outsiders. I'll join you by having Bigs. I know you love it. Yep. Yeah, Bigs are... Bigs are more fresh, but less flavor. Like the beans are very, very, very flavor. It's like super. Yeah. All right, outsiders. Enter a war of uncertainty as you discover the truth behind the house and behind the outsiders. Move, interact, hint. Open drawers to find keys and tools. Don't worry if you die, it's all part of the plan. Uh, this game at least gives you a little bit more hints. Uh, let's listen to the note. Have you uh, heard the tale of Sisyphus? Mm -hmm. uh, once the king of Ephra, Sisyphus was cursed for his boastful deceits with the task of pushing a boulder of immeasurable size up the side of a hill. Mm -hmm. well, upon almost reaching the top, the boulder would always slip his grasp and roll back down the hill. No, in truth, it is not the size of the boulder, the roughness of its sides, or, nor the steepness of the hill that was the real torment. Nor was it simply the futility. His true plight was far more insidious. Now, how was it that the gods compelled him to push the boulder? Did they warp his brain, forcing him to push the rock? Well, if so, then he'd know no other existence and the torture would be nothing unusual. Or did they offer him some grand reward? Surely no. Reward would be worth an eternity of pointlessness. The only answer is that the gods forced him to enjoy the struggle, to embrace the futility, and to only at the end of the grand task realize the pointlessness of it all. Mm. That's life itself. <laughs> Not really. Um, next year, buy the spicy beans. I was searching for the spicy beans polygon, but I could not find them. Like it's very hard to find this kind of stuff in Spain. Oof! I'm gonna send you a lot of bean bolsel by mail. Me or polygon? And the donator can pick which one. Oof. Send me some three spicy noodles. I want to try those. But I remember once I tried like Korean spicy noodles. Holy shit, man. That was like the most spicy thing ever. I also tried Mexican. It was like a burrito kind of thing, but it was not really a burrito. I don't know, but it was super, super spicy. It was like each bite was like, mm, and then you had to be like, 
I breathe in fire for like 10 minutes and then take another bite. <laughs> Me, because you love it? It's okay. It's okay. I'm just doing this because of the spooktober, basically. It's, I think it adds of the fun and the interaction. I'm not going to do it all year. Okay. Right. So we're going to play Outsiders. Here we go. Oh, maybe I skipped the intro. Let me try that again. Classified. The Spicer Rob Wing Cold, there can be only one. Also sounds super alluring. <laughs> Is that the, the logo? Or the catchphrase? Play easy mode. The oh, fuck? Who plays on easy mode? There we go. So we have to find items around the house and escape or something. Wake up! Escape! It's time! Oh shit. Right, here we go. Are these pills why I woke up so violently? Bro, are you okay, Light? You crouch? No. Something isn't right. I don't remember where I am. Where a flashlight? Uh, this is gonna be the last game I'm gonna play for tonight, guys. Anything useful? We're looking for weapons, heals, keys, ball cutters. Am I married? I know, bro. You, are you? <laughs> That's a nice corridor. Oh, there's a medkit there. Oh, the paper. That is the most important. A pencil. Aspirin. Anything useful? I don't like the sound of that. Oh. Take a shower. Ooh, bro, look at this guy. He has a bathtub and a shower. Holy. Look at this bathroom. This bathroom is nice. It's late for you? It's 12.30. It's okay. They were painting, maybe. A hammer? Oh, yes. How do I use a hammer? I don't freaking know. How many people does it take to change a bulb? Depend on the people. Ha! Got him. Hey, neighbors! I'm here! I don't know where I am. I'm trapped in this house. It's not my house. Um... Ooh, a small wrench. <laughs> the, and the hammer just stays there. Okay, we need to remember the hammer is there, okay, guys? There is a cold draft coming from this floor. Cold draft. The secrets. Do we have a baby or something? This looks like a... Not scared of thunders. Calculator. Oh yeah. Ooh. Can I use the wrench there to open the vent? Oh, maybe I need a screwdriver for that. Scissors. A cat! The game has a cat picture. GG. Best game ever. 
A duct tape, yeah, but I cannot take the duct tape either. Yeah, this is a street house. Why will I hang this up? That's a very good question. What the fuck is this picture, bro? A lighter. Smoker. We got a smoker? I need a key to unlock this. Nice TV, Ethan. Why is this picture low resolution? Never trust Kitty got killed by one in Ghost of Dawn. Oh, no. Cookies of milk! Let's fucking go! Tobacco, you. Oh! What the fuck? There's a fucking naked guy running around my house. Why do all these pictures since like stockpot? <laughs> An elf? I don't know. What the fuck was that? Bro, why is the game lagging? Just for the for the rendering. For the rendering for OBS, it lags. But yeah, that's a shame. Because it's in like a well put game. It's in like like escape, like a like granny. It looks like granny. Typical escape the room. Escape the house game. Sad. Yeah. Well, that was for me for tonight. Have a good night, everyone. Thank you for the company. Thank you for the chatting. Thank you for the beaties. Thank you for everything. Hot top stream. <coughs> How did you know? Um, yeah. Catch you, catch you to uh catch you on Wednesday. Bye-bye. Have a good night.